Hello, hi, and welcome back to my cook mysteries. Well, I'm Pamela, and today I'll be talking to you guys uh, about a very important part of our body, which is the lips. <laughs> so yes, because you know when you talk to anybody, your lips they move, and I think after the eyes. Um, uh, I think I I don't know I cannot compare between eyes and lips both are equally important. So yes, I'll be talking to you about how to take care of your lips. Yes, if you guys are interested, then please keep on watching. And before you watch the video, just take a moment and subscribe to the channel. It will mean a lot to me. And uh, do share, do follow me on Instagram, which is Pamela underscore Makeup Mistress. I post interesting content there too. So yes, while talking about taking care of your lips, the first and foremost thing is hydration. <laughs> Hydrating yourself is very important. If you're parched and dry from inside, your lips will definitely dry out. It'll flake and it'll look very, very bad. You know, even if you have fever, you can see that your lips become pale and dry and whatnot. So yes, if you are healthy inside, if you are hydrated inside, then your lips will definitely glow. Do consume vitamin C in your daily diet, be it lemon, be it any other fruit, be it anything. Please do consume vitamin C. It, it will give that extra glow to your skin as well and make your lips look supple and pink. Never apply lipstick which are very old. You should be discarding those lipsticks that are really old and you've overused them and still unable to finish them. Please do throw them away because uh, yeah, you're just doing very, very, very harsh things to your lips. They're very delicate. They're very good to you always. So please do take care of them and do not apply those lipsticks that are expired. Please throw them away. So these days we are doing a lot to our lips because we are these days applying those matte and liquid lipsticks. They do stick to our lips for hours and they are really hard to remove. So yes, please do remove your lipstick. Do buy a lipstick remover separately. Use coconut oil, do anything. But remove your lipstick when you are back from uh, your work. So always do remove your lipstick before you go off to your bed. The next very important thing is we always say that do you sunscreen, do you sunscreen even if you are at home and everything. So yes, using SPF on your lips are also equally important. So for that I have the Neutrogena Lip Moisture SPF 15 for you guys and this condition protects dry chapped lips as well as it has SPF so it protects you from the UV rays of the sun too. So yes, do get your hand on this one and your life will be sorted trust me so um, using SPF on your lip is please please do make sure that you use it the next thing is lip scrubbing it is so important you can buy the market uh, you know bought once they're equally good if you don't want to buy them you can just make them at home using coconut oil sugar and few drops of lemon you just mix together you can just put it in a container like this and you can use it all you need to do is you have to take a little amount and just a little amount and then just Massage it. On the corners. And then just wipe it clean. I 
and you'll get soft supple without any chap anything without any dryness you'll get your soft and supple lips in just a jiffy and after you have scrubbed your lips don't forget to use your lip balm so i always prefer lip balms which are not tinted because mm, if i want tint i'll use a lipstick it hardly matters so yes that is totally up to you if you want you can definitely use but according to me i don't need any tint uh, if i'm using only lip balm <laughs> scrubbing of your lips is equally important just the way you scrub your face to remove all the dead cells all the dryness and just you know uh, the, so that your skin looks fresh and vibrant and glowy same goes for the lips you need to scrub them off too and um, this will ensure that your lips are never dry or chapped or something like that so there are many uh, you know whitening uh, lip treatment out in the market but then i think uh, using coconut oil lemon juice and sugar is more than enough you can definitely use uh, just coconut oil to lather your lips before you go to bath and uh, even when you sleep so you know uh, uh, coconut oil has natural bleaching agent so if your lips are really dry and um, uh, your lips are turning black so yeah it will definitely help you and uh, the last thing i think uh, i think i should not i i need not mention this that um, do not smoke because it really uh, you know um, makes your lips uh, look ugly uh, you know yeah not for all but then yeah it does so yeah that was it and uh, yeah i think that was pretty much about it and it was informative i think and you all liked it then please do hit the like button do share it with your friends and family and subscribe to makeup mistress this will mean a lot to me and i'll see you guys really soon with some new content till then stay gorgeous